What's up, guys? My name's Miller, and we're going way back in time for episode 15, sorry, episode 16 of the Her Interactive Minigames series. Um, raise your hand if you guys remember this amazing website right here, way back in the day when everything was so cool. It was just, oh, it was so fun back when things actually, back when the website was cool. In my opinion, this is when the website was cool. Oh, look at that. It was $14.99. Back in uh, 2004. Amazing, that. Yeah, no, man, this is the day. This was the day. Uh, the day, sorry, the, the, the time to be alive. Um, Her Interactive actually made a bit of an interactive web demo for uh, Secret, Secrets Can Kill. Not really a web demo, but more just like information about the game. Um, and these links still work as far as I am aware. Uh, so we've got Who Did It, Come Meet the Suspects, uh, Explore Paseo Del Mar, and uh, Discover Clues, and Behind the Scenes of a 3D Development. So we've got this here. This is the suspects. So there's four students at Paseo Del Mar High, um, and they can shed some light on the crime. They're all suspects. Could one of them be the murderer, right? We've got um, uh, Daryl, we got Hal, Connie, and uh, Hulk, right? So, uh, yeah, you can just click on each of these guys here. They'll bring you to a little info page about them. Daryl's a smooth-talking high school senior who always gets his girl. He's probably popular with his classmates and in the town, but if Daryl doesn't get his way, you see a darker, shadowy side that's manipulating and cunning. And back in the day, you could click here to hear Daryl's voice, but doesn't doesn't really work anymore. So I just, you know, just thought, I'd, thought I'd just share that there. Now if we go back here, we can check out Hal. Um, same thing goes for him. You, can, you could have been able to hear his voice, but not anymore. Hal is a shy and a bit nervous. Hal is shy and a bit nervous, but he just wants to fit in with the American teenage culture. He studies a lot and has a spiritual side, but he's also ambitious and needs to earn a scholarship if he wants to stay in the states. Hype. All right. Hal's not a friend or foe. Boom. Uh, and then we got Connie Watson here. Once it loads. Uh, how ambitious is she? Who who knows? Click here to hear Connie Watson talks. So obviously, the background must be missing or whatever from here because it's clearly like the tan that was on the other ones, but whatever. Uh, Connie is athletic, ambitious, and competitive, and is determined to be the first person in her family to go to college. Under her defensive "I'm as tough as any guy" act, she's vulnerable and sweet. Does anyone? Does she only want what? Uh, sorry. Does she only want to do the right thing? All right. We've got. Uh, Hulk Sanchez. Hulk is the senior wise guy and super jock who tends to be rude and crude, but he also has a good sense of humor and a thoughtful side. He's, he is so intent on his dream of becoming a professional athlete that he's willing to break some rules to make it happen. And uh, that's it. That's the suspects. So the next one was uh, Explore Paseo del Mar. So we have a small version of the map from in-game, and you can click on different locations and it'll bring you there. So we've got and again, none of these these click to hear links work, but we can click to enter max scenes and whatnot, and then all of a sudden we can just go through a bit of a slideshow of images. And not all the images are there, as you will soon see. I think it's the next one that's not here or something. Oh, maybe maybe not. There, like right, some of the images just don't exist anymore. But but yeah, no, it was cool. It's is a little cool cool dealio here, right? Do the same thing with Paseo del Mar and and Eloise's house. You can just sort of look around, uh, try try before you buy sort of game, uh, not game, uh, but yeah, it's brilliant. And then we have uh, behind the scenes of the 3D development, so this is cool here, we've got the making of Secrets Can Kill, <laughs> and it's literally just a GIF, right? It's just, yeah, it's, I don't know, it's it's kind of cool actually. Oh, there's, I didn't even see it, it's, it's all in yellow, you can't hardly see that, but there is yellow text. Grab a look behind the scenes and see how this unique role-playing mystery game was developed. Behind the scenes segments were created by rendering 3D frames at different stages of, of development. And uh, once it loops around here, I'll show you what, what they're talking about here. First frame is a skeletal model of the environment right there. Second frame adds the skin and the bones to, the, to give the model substance. Third frame adds textures and patterns to the skin. And the fourth brings in the full lighting and reflections and whatnot. And yeah, and that's just the gist of animation in... A GIF with yellow text. That's that's it. But anyways, that's it. That's the quote unquote web demo thing that they had for uh, Seekers and Kill way back in the day. So that's pretty cool. Um, 
yeah, I don't know. It's just it's it's cool just to go back and take a look at this stuff and whatnot. And uh, yeah, I've got uh, two more videos here. I'm going to show you. The next one is "Stay Tuned for Danger," and the final one is "Treasure in the Royal Tower." It's got three more episodes for the Her Interactive Minigame series. It's hype. Thank you all for watching this, and um, that's about it. I'll see you in Stay Tuned for Danger. Have a good one, everybody.